Stop. Listen. Can you hear that? Homework policies. I bet you can't hear it. Because Mona Shores has never had a homework policy. It never should. We have all had homework before in our lives, either too much or too little. Either way, we've all had it. After deliberately um, examining three articles, I have figured out what homework policy really is and what its definition is and what it could do for Mona Shores and what it can't do. I believe Mona Shores should steer away from homework policy and stay with the old ways instead of adding it and causing chaos. Um, so pretty much what a homework policy is, is it would regulate how much homework you would get so the teachers don't get to pick. You get a certain amount of time scheduled for each class. And you may be wondering why I wouldn't want to regulate homework. Well, it's pretty much, I'll start out with this. Other countries, they do it, and they're excelling at it. But I'll just say this, Americans are lazy until a goal gets put in front of us, and that goal is homework, so we have to finish it. And then another thing, um, Chicago parents and other parents around the world are saying that it has almost doubled the amount of homework that they had when they were kids, but the fact is, it's the world has changed so much, so we need to learn those things that have changed, so we need more homework. And uh, so now, what the other people, what the opposition thinks. So Chicago parents, one woman said that her third grader had two hours of homework. I can understand that that's a lot for a third grader. That's the recommended amount for a middle school or high school student. And another point stated that why don't we just try it out? Most of the schools that actually tried this system, all their high school students one class of juniors, almost every single student failed. Because once you cut down on homework, you cut down on the learning, and it's as simple as that. People are going to fail if they don't know the information. And then, this is just to add to on the ongoing list. Um, Connie Murphy, an instructor, um, said that homework is a great thing and it's a part of her lifestyle. One time her kid came home with a really bad spelling grade and she sat down with her for three hours and pulled up a book and every single word that she didn't know she had to spell it out. And her child ended up coming home with a hundred. So the facts are there. Even if you don't want homework, it's pretty obvious. If we don't have homework, we're gonna fail. Homework is described as a way of life for us it's the way we learn. Without it, we wouldn't be able to fit all of it in. Homework is for teachers to add more onto their lessons. So I discussed at the beginning how you weren't able to hear a school policy, but now I hope you don't want to hear a school policy. Thank you.